friends, and welcome back to the beautiful world of Kingdom Come Deliverance. I just had my first crash ever in this whole playthrough so far. Um, I've had really good luck with game performance and um, like game breaking glitchiness. I have had glitches here and there in the game, but nothing that made me say like, oh my god, I can't play anymore. But uh, what happened was like when I ended the last video, I paused um, during that quest with Teresa when we were on our way to go on our date. I paused and then I went to go get a drink, came back, unpaused it to start the video, and then it, it crashed, um, which is very strange. But um, so I just need to talk to Teresa one more time and go on our date again. But that's fine. That's fine. Um, and before we do this, I would like to address one other thing that has been talked about in the comments pertaining to why I don't reload when things like when I screw things up or when I get a, like a bad outcome to a quest. Um, specifically, uh, people were upset that I messed up the sermon with the priest in um, episode 20. And um, my only explanation is that I don't like to reload and I like to live with consequences in games, especially in this game, because it is a heavily choice based game. And um, it's one of the only, there's not that many games that give you consequences like this game does and have, has this many different outcomes to quests and um, just events in the game. And I, I really value that. And I feel like it's really, really cheesy in a bad way to reload when I screw something up. It's my fault or Henry's fault. In that case, it was my fault. But it totally made sense that Henry screwed it up because number one, he was extremely hungover. They were drinking when he heard the sermon in the first place. He had no idea he was going to have to memorize it. So what person, even if it was like a really smart person that had an ex excellent memory, if you don't know to memorize something, you're not trying. So like, sure, maybe he could have thought of a, of a few lines, but I think the way that it played out in the end with Henry screwing that up was totally realistic. <laughs> and I was I was happy with that outcome um, because I know that the game is gonna give me another chance to redeem myself. And the more interesting these quest lines are and the more I screw them up and test the limits of the game is just more fun for me. Now I know that there's a lot of people that get annoyed at that and like, or the kind of people that um, just want to, hey Teresa, I just don't want you to go to bed. <laughs> are the type of people that just want to reload and get the, the best possible outcome. And I realize it can be frustrating watching someone that doesn't want that, but that is unfortunately for you how I play video games. So I apologize if you don't like that, but that is how I will be continuing to play. And if you complain about it, I really do not care what you have to say. So that's that. Anyways, we're going to go on a date with Teresa now that that's out of the way. And yeah. How about now? Hopefully the game doesn't Fancy crash walk this time. To the town. That sounds wonderful. Everyone says the Broken Wheel Tavern is the fun place to be in the evening. I want you to take me there. Have you the ever broken been? Broken Wheel me and my Tavern. What do you think? Why not? I will. Let's be going. All right. I already listened to that in the last episode, so that's why I skipped it. Now, I'm going to try following her there. Luckily, by the way, I didn't have to replay much after it crashed. Go to taverns the... a lot, do you? Sorry. Sometimes. If I want a proper meal, I have to. You wouldn't want to eat the stuff I cook. <laughs> That's true. That's probably true, I yeah. haven't forgotten that bet you made back in Scallets that time. Don't talk about those oat cakes. Fritz's belly heaves at the very mention, even now. And that's <laughs> where you go to woo wenches, is it? Yeah, naturally. The taverns and baths are where the best ones gather. You yeah. lout. There's no need to take it the wrong way. I'm not taking it any way at all. It's all right. I'm only joking. I don't go picking up women in taverns. I prefer a different sort. What sort might that be? All that mouth sort. And green eyes. You're such a. <laughs> Come on then. Come on then. Oh. <laughs> so. Oh, we, we did it. <laughs> should we? It's this uh, tavern. Should we order something? Yes, definitely. Uh, <clears throat> Service. <laughs> oh, a pair of lovebirds. <laughs> what would you like to order? <clears throat> mm. Ah, chili. Yeah, Medieval right. chili. It's classic. Excellent. <laughs> this ale, there's no better in the province. Mm, you know what? <laughs> Ooh, we're going to dance. What? What are you doing? 
Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, <laughs> come on, Henry. But, but, but really? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, come on, be brave. No, I've never... Hand on my hip. I, I don't even know how. And off we go. But, but really, <laughs> I, I don't know how. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing just fine. All right. His spurs. Be careful, Henry. No, it's... All right. It's fine. <laughs> 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 oh, very nice. So cute. <laughs> Not so bad. <laughs> now someone's going to come along and ruin it, right? <laughs> you wore me out. And you said you couldn't dance. How about a dance with a real man? Oh, snap. How about snap. you leave me alone and bother someone else? Oh, come on. It's a crime to waste a body like that on a scrawny boy like him. Oh, you got scrawny. tits like a cow in calf. Oh, that's it. I like a woman to fight before I fuck her. Oh, you're going down, bro. You'll pay for that, boy. Oh, yeah? I'm not sure how I could squish your nose any farther into your face, but I'm gonna try. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna, you're gonna regret that, sir. Yeah, get him, Henry. Ooh, way off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go. Yeah. Get him. Punch, flurry. Yes. I got. Oh, we need him in the face. That got good. Well, Gee. say say sorry. <coughs> say sorry. I have way more stamina than you. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> what an asshole. Oh, come on. I didn't even get hit. My hero. Does it hurt? No. Oh, you no. should worry about the other fella. Look, I'm I've had fine. worse. Ow! Of course I got you shot are. three That's times yesterday. That's why every time I touch you. Stabbed. You saw him off, though. He wasn't feeling so playful after you'd finished with him. That tickles. It <laughs> tickles. Aww. They're gonna fall so, in love. You'll probably be fine. Oh, yeah. I'll I'm try fine. to give your hands some rest. Don't go lifting anything too heavy. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I'll take you home. Oh, you never give up. Are you sure you don't need a bit more rest? I can find my own way home. I'll manage those few extra steps. Come on then, hero. Yeah, after that, I want to ask you you home. Plus, it's nighttime. I should probably sleep. I sleep in the same place you sleep, so. I'll give you this. Nights out with you might be painful. But they're never boring. I do my best. <laughs> well, you should go in before Peshek starts fretting. I mean, we both live here. Kiss? Kiss, 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 yay! <laughs> so Disney. Oh. All right, Henry, now just casually wait one minute for her to get to bed and then walk in after her. <laughs> oh. Ooh, we're going to go on a third date. You know what happens on the third date, right? Ooh. Uh-oh. Peshik. He was watching. Peshik, are you angry? God save you, you. What can I do for you? Do you approve of this? How'd you get mixed up in thieving? You've an honest trade. How come you got mixed up in crime? Evil times. The harvest failed. And there was no grain to mill. And a child to feed on top of it all. I had no choice. And meanwhile, the lords in the castle and the monks in the monastery stuffed their craws to bursting. Where's the justice in that? So you took justice into your own hands, is that it? And now you take whatever you need? Pull your head out of your ass, Henry. <laughs> take a good look around you. Wars come and go, but nothing really changes. 
It's the poor that do the dying and the nobles who reap the rewards. We have to survive somehow. So why concern ourselves with morals? I agree. Um, I honestly, that was a stupid thing to say, Henry, because you're doing the same thing as he, he is. Are you sure that's doing any good, Teresa? Are you sure? Do you want to go on another date already? I know it's said in a few days, but... How about Let's another little anyway. with me? You never give up, do you? No. That would be great. Only not just now. Come and see me in a day or two. All right. Don't call the lady in for, you know, after your date. You gotta wait two days, as customary. Are we hungry? I, th I assume we just ate, but eh, we're gonna... We'll go till tomorrow. I don't want to get overfed. Okay, um, do I have anything that I want to shove in here? No, I am good. Except I did get in a fight, so I would like to try and repair my stuff. Can't repair that. Yeah. Boop. Awesome. Sleep and save. Sleep and save. All right, um, we are going to sleep until nine and we have two things to do. The first thing we're gonna do is go and see Hans. I think he should be up by nine, hopefully. And if he's not up, then we will go and grab the wine from the merchant for Stephanie's quest. That is the last item that we need for Stephanie's quest. And um, <clears throat> I'm excited to see the conclusion. I hope I get huge browning points with the the, the, the the lords of Tomburg. I hope, I hope, I hope. And then we will be going back to, well, first we'll need to go back to tell Fritz and Matthew that they have a job, that's important. And then probably going to Tomburg, I think. Game save. <clears throat> By the way, the save and quit um, thing works really well. I like it. Okay. Uh, I do probably have some stolen things I could sell. Why is this door not a door? Oh, because Teresa was opening it. Sure. <laughs> okay. Let's actually see if my horse has any stolen items for us to sell. Probably does. Uh, I actually I don't feel I don't feel like bartering right now. I'm just gonna uh, just I'm feeling too lazy, you know. So, um, how do I get to where Hans is? It's a quest giver in there. We better go see who that is. What's this? Oh, the wine. Right, right. Yeah, we definitely want to go here. Yes, I'm fast traveling because yes, I'm lazy. Also, it'll be almost 10, and that's better. It's better for everyone. Okay, here we go. Rate, my best friend Rate. Mm, I think I'll buy the wine last. Townsman! Can I go in here? No. Hello, guard. Clearly not in there. Are you Let's serious? Yeah, I am serious. Oh, wow. What's it to you? What's it to you, buddy? Is it in here? <clears throat> Aha. Yes. Oh. Oh, there he is. Hans. He's the one with the quest. God be with you, lad. What can oh I do Oh my god, you? you look awful. Didn't they give you a bath yet? Holy crap. How goes it, sir? Are you recovered? I am. For all the good it does. The boredom here. The only thing I have to read is the Bible. And the Hanush won't let anyone near me but the priest. Have you any idea the monotonous drivel that fella comes out with? Why haven't this you changed your clothes? Is not Be repentant. He talks to me as if I'm about to breathe my last. Actually, he talks to me as if I were already dead. Listen, Henry, won't you come with me to the Rate Bars? Yes. I need a change of scene before moss starts growing on me. Yes, I will. Um, what about your wounds? But what about your wounds, sir? 
I won't lie to you, it hurts like the devil. But I'd rather hobble along with a cane, howling in pain, than listen to a selection of the most boring passages from the Gospels for one more minute. Yes, Why not? we will. When do you want to go? I shall go there right away, but wait until at least dusk to join me. I'll have company there. All right, I'll come and join you there. But I guess I already did cheat on Teresa technically about our about hunt. our hunt <laughs> with the priest. All right, all right, I admit it. Trying to kill a ball with a bow and arrow wasn't the best idea I've ever had. No, it wasn't. <laughs> it was a nice shot though. There you go. Best friends forever. What the hell? Dude, Hans, seriously, though. Damn! Okay, is this a chest? Is this... It's not really a chest, huh? Well, that's nice. What a lovely view from the window, though. Lovely. Okay, I'm glad it didn't lock me in there. That would be really annoying. Okay. Um, the baths are... Where are the baths? That's a good question. I think there are, are they like one of these houses? Probably. Well, Hans, it'll there'll be a um, marker on him anyway. So let's let's go get the wine, I guess. I just don't understand why he didn't change his clothes yet. It's been over. It's been like a week. Somebody surely gave him a bath. <laughs> All right, Hans, Henry, whatever you say. You came. Yeah, yeah, I'll see you later, Hans. You big goof. Where's my vagabond? Ringlet? You have a name. That's weird. I hope I can be of some humble service to you. Uh... Aren't you Ringlet? Oh. Milan says I have to beat you before he'll take me on. Oh, this is one of the brawl guys. You know that blacksmith's lad, right? What do you want out of it? You're not living in the dirt here like the rest of us. Maybe not. But why shouldn't I try and beat some coin out of him too? Yeah, and you can pass it on to us that need it. If you want to fight me, you dandy, then pay up. Or fuck off. Fine. Two groschen. That's nothing. Alright. Come on. I've fought enough people today. I can, I can kick your... Ah! But... <laughs> yep, yep. It's all about that stamina, man. He's already down. And and you're dead. Oh, come on, you're so dead. Just give it up, dude. There we go. Oh my god, he's not dead, is he? <gasps> I didn't mean to kill him! I'm really sorry! <laughs> I hope nobody saw that. I think we're safe. I think... I think we're good, unless somebody from that house was spying on us. Oh boy. <laughs> Did I eat breakfast? <laughs> okay. Uh, yes. I think he was dead. I'm pretty sure he was dead. <laughs> Whoops. Let's just add that to the list of embarrassing things Henry's done in his time after Scallets. Let's go buy some wine and try and do something smart. Dark at home? A torch will help. Your fields lie fallow. Here's a hoe. Hear ye. Okay. Hear ye, hear ye. Hello, good shopkeeps. Hear about some wine, Conrad. Good health to you. Good health to you. Lady Stephanie of Talmberg sent me to... And what would she like? Fine clothes from Venice? Exquisite spices from Arabia? Jewels from Germany? 
Wine. No. Good wine. Ah. Well, there's a problem. Uh, we don't have any good wine. You have to go find it. Would beer be enough? No. As a gift for a noble woman's wedding? No, it definitely wouldn't. Then that's going to be a problem. I gave the last keg of good wine away as a prize for the archery competition tomorrow. Oh, shit. You're telling me I have to win this competition to get this wine? Where are we? Isn't there anywhere else where I could find the wine? Unfortunately not. I have the exclusive right to sell and buy that particular vintage. No one else in the region will stop it. Oh Can my I enroll God. in the competition? <sighs> but of course. Go to the shooting range above Ratai. What if I don't win? But what if I don't win the competition? Yeah. Then you'll have to persuade the winner to part with some truly Persuade. excellent wine. Uh, I suppose I'll just have to find a way to get it. I'm sorry, there's nothing more I can do to help. Can I just steal it? <laughs> can, I, can I literally just steal it? Because I would do that. Um, what kind of crap do you have, sir? Quality arrows? Haggle. <laughs> Let's talk about the price. Some other way. Well, Look, we can try it. Who is holding on to the wine right now? Is it like, is it just sitting around by the archery place? Are we agreed? Because. Come now, just a or little maybe more. Here. And we have maybe a he's, maybe he's like, has to bring it there still. Finally, a reasonable sum. Hmm. I should I should break in tonight and see if I can steal the wine. <laughs> that is what I should do, you know. It is. Is there a back way into his place? Going upstairs. I might be able to break in right now, actually. This is probably a bad idea. Especially because this is probably going to alert somebody. Oof. New level in lockpicking, though. Oh god, did he see me? I wasn't doing anything! I definitely wasn't what doing are anything! Doing here? Uh, are you after something? No, I'm fine. Everything's fine. Don't worry about it. I'm not- I'm definitely not trying to steal from a shop. Are you gonna lock the door again? Because that's most inconvenient, I must say. Okay, I definitely should wait until evening to do that, but let's go check out the archery range and um, enroll in the contest, I guess. We might as well take part in that. It'll be fun, if anything, I suppose. Stop right there. I have to search you. No, I. it's fine. It's fine. I didn't do anything. I don't even think I have anything stolen. All right, fine. What? Come on! I didn't what? do anything. I, pro I didn't... For security reasons. Uh-huh. Because of what? Oh. Oh my god, it takes a lot to beat these guys. Um, how about I pay you in... S I have a, a stolen lockpick, I think. It's fine, search As me. you wish. I didn't do anything. Are you yanking my pizzle? Hand over all the stolen goods you have. I'll be keeping an eye on you. Now, you can enter. He took my stolen lockpick. Dang it. I loved that stolen lockpick that I got from Fritz. <laughs> oh, hey. Hey, Hanush, what's up? Greetings. What do you need? I don't know. Um, oh. He's causing me problems. Uh, Sir, so, I met the parish priest of Ujits, and I must say he's a very interesting man. I should say so. Have you ever seen him at swordplay? Not bad for a man of the cloth, is he? Rumor no? has it, when he finished his studies at the university where his father sent him, he decided the religious life wasn't for him, and vanished to foreign parts. They say he made a living as a mercenary. I even heard he fought against the Turk at the Battle of Kosovo. And then he suddenly came back and settled down here. 
No doubt it cost his family plenty. But he's a fair man, and I'm fond of him. There's a lot to be said for a priest with a good understanding of vice. Yeah, I liked him. But he is causing me some problems. Sahana's father Godwin and Ujits is causing me problems. What? You too? But I don't suppose you're getting visits from the diocese. Oh, uh, no, sir. I tracked down that bandit from Neuhof, but he'd been killed. He confessed to Godwin before he died. Only Godwin won't tell me what he said. I tried to, um, <laughs> come to some arrangement with him. Mm -hmm. and now he won't talk to me at all. Well, the confessional seal is sacred, and Godwin has his own mind. There are those who would tell you everything for a handful of coin or a keg of wine. We are one of those right here in the presbytery. But Godwin won't budge once he's made his mind up. Except maybe for the bishop. Well, that's not an option here. I know, lad. I'm afraid I can't help you. If no one in Ujits knows anything, you have even less chance here. We did have some troublemaker from Ujits in the pillory here once, but whether it was the fellow you're after... It might be worth having a look at the Rat A Black Chronicle. Or ask the scribe. It's worth a try. Thank you for the advice, sir. Okay, I know where the scribe is. I do. Thank you, Hanish. I am very glad that I came to talk to you. Talk to the scribe. Look for the Black Chronicle for any record of Lubash. Is that... Is the Black Chronicle, like, something I would have to read? Because that's not happening right now. Uh -huh. I was gonna go to this archery thing, but now I'm- now I'm sidetracked. Again. I'm- I'm, like, kind of bent on the idea of stealing the keg of wine. I hope to god that that's an option, because I will love this game forever. And I already do love it forever, but, you know. The scribe should be in the same building as the- oh, you bastards. Same building as the bailiff up here. With all these scrolls around. Hello, Mr. Scribey Scribe. Oh, that's the bailiff. Jesus <laughs> we'll talk to him praised. anyway. Hey, bailiff, what's going on? Uh, ooh! Yeah. I'm on the trail of the bandits who raided Neuhof, and I need to look in the Black Chronicle. I'm hoping there might be a record of one Lubosch from Ujits and his accomplices. Lubosch from Ujits, eh? Called Limpy? Yes, mm -hmm. that's the fellow. You remember him? I remember him and the other two reprobates who were disturbing the peace here. Do you remember Ooh. their names? Only this Limpy stuck in my mind. I can't remember every wastrel who passes through here. There was oh, one from Vlashim and a third one from somewhere nearby. I can't remember where. But that should all be in the Black Vlash. Chronicle. All you have to do is take a look. Only... What? I can't read. I can't let you do that alone. And Friedrich the Scribe is at home sick. Dang it. You can go and see him. Tell him I sent you and work something out with him. I'll pay him. Where is he? Where does he live? Can I ask you that? Uh, okay. Apparently not. Where does he sleep? Is the main quest gonna... Oh, he's here. He's here. Okay. He does sleep here. Excuse me, sir. Good day to you. I need to have a look in the Black Chronicle, Friedrich. And I need blessed relief from my suffering. May the Lord have mercy. Well, I don't know what I can do for you except bring you a priest. I'm not dying yet. I just can't get up. I'm sorry but to hear. But you did get up. But I'm on the trail of those killers from Neuhof, and I need to know the names of the men who were sentenced alongside Limpy Lubosch from Ujits. I can't remember. Once I write the record down, it goes straight out of my head. It's essential that I find out those names. Is there anything I can do to help you get back to work? I can't go to work when I can't stand on my feet. But you Conyash are standing on your feet. The has an embrocation that helps, but it costs dearly. Ugh. If you brought me some, it might do the trick. Look, I don't even know how this is how this is going to help anyway right. cuz I can't I'll read. Try and get some for you. And I know it's not going to let me ask him to read it for me cuz that would make too much sense. It's 
Someone had a little misfortune with the torch here, it looks like. <laughs> that was a close one. Although it is stone. Well, no, the ceiling is wood, so it could have caught fire. Very dangerous. All right, well, at least we're getting somewhere, I suppose. Not doing the same, the correct progress that I wanted to do, but let's go see how much the apothecary person wants for this supposed potion. Hey, you look a lot like the dude I just beat up. Were you the dude Heavens I just beat up? Lad. You're looking bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. Last he time is. I saw you, I thought you were ready for the priest. Uh, I'm healthy again. I'm feeling as good as new. Well, I'm glad to hear it. Debt. What debt? What did I forget? What is this about? About that debt. I won't pay anything. I don't know what I owe him for, but I'll pay Here him. There you are. I don't remember. Thank you. Is I'm it... glad to oh. see you're a man of honor. Is there anything else I can do for Wait you? Wait a second. This is for... This is because... This is because the freaking Miller guy, Peshik, bought potions to help me when I was sick, but I already paid Peshik. Hmm. Something tells me I didn't get such a good deal out of that. Oh, well. Scribe Friedrich <laughs> needs the embrocation for his it. joints. What, again? He was here not long ago for some. He ought to make it last longer. I told him not to grease himself up so much. It could cause... Oh, the older he gets, the more foolish he is. Well, did he tell you such salvation is costly? Have a look in the shop for yourself. I... I don't know what... What... What? Aesop potion? Horses and dogs will love you. Increases your horsemanship. Put strength in your blood. I don't know which one it is. Was this what he said? Oh, there. Yeah. Eeks and bones and joints. That's not that much. That's fine. I'll even buy two more marigold decoctions from you. Nighthawk. Ten minutes you can see better in the dark. Ooh, let's grab one of those, too. That sounds fun. Source energy. What's Lazarus? Cool, cool. I could use this. I could totally use this before the competition tomorrow. That seems like a pretty damn good idea. Digestion potion. That'd probably come in handy too. Let's get one of those. Okay, um, do I wanna sell you anything? Not really, I think I'll just pay this. I know it's a lot, but this stuff will come in handy. Let's haggle. Can we do something about the price? Hmm. See if we can get him down to like, 350. Since it's gonna, you. He's, he's not gonna go down that That's far. That's not enough. Alright, what do you want then? It's probably gonna piss him off a lot. Yeah, I thought so. Alright, how about 370? Alright, so? Here we go. Thank you, friend. Let's go give this to the scribe and see if we can even make this happen. Uh, it might not even be a thing that I could do, but I'm gonna try. Get the scribe to help you. I'm worried that it's just gonna be like, oh, here's the book. Oh, you can't read it? Well then, too bad. Where's this guy? Oh yeah, he's upstairs. Sleeping. Definitely not able to wake to stand up. Even though he's gonna stand up again. My respect to you, sir. <sighs> Here you go. I bought you the embrocation. And you were right, it certainly wasn't cheap. I know, lad. I've been using it for years. Hmm. Will you let me have a look at the Black Chronicle? Well, you helped me, so now I'll help you. Come along, and I'll show you our Black Chronicle. That really is a miraculous ointment. You haven't even rubbed it on, and it's already working. <laughs> you know how it is. Faith itself is the greatest healer. 
Just thinking about the relief it will bring makes me feel better. So don't look a gift horse in the mouth. Come along. Probably just doesn't even do anything. Dude's making a steal from your bone aches from his expensive cell that doesn't even do anything. Yeah, yeah. Are we here? I can't read. Can you read it for me? Uh, could you find something for me in that book? The thing is, I don't, um... Don't know how to read, do you? So what do you need to know? Whew, I'm good. trying to track down those Neuhoff cutthroats, and I need to find out the names of any cronies of Limpy Lubosch from Ujits. Hmm. Give me a while. Okay, so we trade time. Hey, watch it! Mm. Folk these days. I'm sorry. I apologize. Okay, um, where's this other... Look through the Black Chronicle for Lubash. And here's the archery contest. Where's A, though? A is here as well. I think they're, like, both on him. Unless A is pointing to the bailiff, maybe. Yeah, okay. It's fine. God, that out of breath thing is. Oh shit. Sorry, sorry. That out of breath thing is so annoying. Because, um. <sighs> it's just when I, like, do the pause menu and stuff. Alright, let's see if I can get. Lock is too difficult, but I've done hard before. Come on. Okay. Run away. Run away. <laughs> oh, okay. Nobody, nobody caught me. It's everything's fine. Everything is uh, gonna be okay. All right. What do we do now? We're gonna give him a while, so we'll probably come back in the morning or something. I guess we'll go sign up for the archery contest. Carrots and apples. I don't think I can remember how to get down there. Ah, yeah, here we go. All right, let's join. You get by any chance? Do you have this? Do you have a keg of wine sitting around? Jesus! Just... Look where you're going. Hey, watch it. Lout. You're a lout. No, I suppose it would be pretty hard to steal anyway, because it'd be very heavy. Good health to you. Hi, I'd like to join the competition. I've heard there's a contest happening, and that the prize is a keg of fine wine. That's true. I bought the finest wine to be had in the province. I'd like to take part. Do you know the rules? Nope. I don't. You shoot seven, thirteen, or twenty-one arrows, depending on who you're shooting against. The straw surround is worth one point. The white ring, two, and the bullseye, three. Okay. Whoever finishes shooting first gets three extra points. The round ends when everyone has finished shooting, and whoever has the most points wins. It's the custom to wager on it, to make it more interesting, see? The better archers you shoot against, the higher the stakes. All right, that seems straightforward. Just one more thing. Don't leave while the contest is underway, and never aim or shoot at anything but the target. Otherwise, you're out. Got it? Got it. Splendid. Here's some arrows for you. But you can use your own if you want. Meanwhile, I'll round up the competition. Oh, we're doing it now. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm trying to use my bow. Is it not equipped? Oh, shit. Tournament arrows. <laughs> Why aren't I equipped with my bow? There we go. God, God, I'm already losing because of that. Okay, come on. We gotta catch up, Henry. Come on. Oh, boy. Come on. That was a good one. Good God, that traitor guy is a badass. I 
I hope we're not only shooting seven, otherwise I'm doomed. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Come on, Henry. I'm not doing well. That, that, <laughs> at the beginning was pretty bad. 32 points. Well, I, I did just really bad. Because of my freaking bow wasn't equipped. I mean, I did better than the townsman, but I'm a lot slower. Get the wine some other way. <laughs> Shit. Okay. I failed to win the archery contest, unfortunately. That's okay, because I wasn't expecting to win it anyways. So, now I need to try and talk this guy into giving me the I'll wine. Hi. Actually, hold on a second. Hold on a sec. Am I dirty? Shit. Is there a way that I could, you know, wash up really quick? I'm just gonna go, uh... Just gonna take a second here and wash up. How am I looking now? Good! Awesome! Alright, now we want to take off this, because that gives me more. That. Pardon me, traitor, sir. Why? Congratulations on your victory. Yes. Thank you. I can't wait to drink to it. Yes, and um, on the subject of drinking, I'm guessing you prefer beer to wine. <laughs> no, not really. I could drink beer in any tavern, but there's no wine as good as this one. It's just that the wine you won, I need it. Not a yeah. chance. I won it fairly. Ooh. You wouldn't want to disappoint Lady Stephanie. You don't want to disappoint Lady Stephanie of Talmberg and her courier, do you? Lady Stephanie, you say? I've always liked her ladyship. Mm. Uh -huh. You know what then? Take the keg. And please give her my respectful greetings. Okay. Dude, Damn. what What if I was lying? Are you serious? It's, there's such a weird combination of trusting and untrustworthy people in this game. <laughs> like, if, if, I was, if I was that guy, I'd be like, you're so full of shit. Why should I give this to you just because you say that? But maybe, maybe I'm just a very suspicious person. I don't know. All right, well, that worked out. Let's go check if um, the scribe is done <laughs> with uh, getting me my names. That'd be nice. I hope that this actually does progress the main quest and I don't have to look elsewhere because I, yeah. I feel a bit bad that I, I didn't, I wasn't friends with the priest in the end, but like I said, I, I did enjoy how it played out. I thought it made sense. Oh, there's a lot of smoke. I guess that, that doesn't make sense. It just is, it seems a little dangerous, you know, to have that happen with wood around. But what do I know? Again, what do I know? Absolutely not. Hey, are you? Okay, you're the bailiff. You done? You're not, you're not there anymore, so... Will you let me have a look at the black cross? Well, you helped me, so... That really is a... You know how it... Wait, was I supposed to just wait there by you? Is that why? Did I screw that up? I thought he meant come back in a while. You know? Maybe I, did. Maybe I was wrong about that. Oh, boy. You can do it. I believe in you, sir. Be a bit more careful. Is this it? Are we stopping here? Can't read. Uh, don't know how to. I'm trying to. Hmm. Okay, so give him a while, and then he goes over here. Maybe I'll just wait here for him.
You done? Oh, okay, so it was that fast. So did My you bad. find any mention of Limpy in the book? I did. Apart from Lubosh, there's mention of some Anton from Vlashim and Hinek, known as Riki, from Ledechko. Uh, That's a stone throw from here. Aye, Riki. certainly closer than Vlashim. Thanks for your help. Yes, we're getting to the Thank part of, that the, ointment. of the main quest that took place in the beta. That's exciting to me. That's very exciting. Okay, um, that's awesome. Henry moves in mysterious ways. Uh. Okay, I'm in a private area. Oh shit, I'm sorry. I apologize. On this freaking scent, hell yes. Okay, this is exciting because now we need to track down Riki. And Riki was in Tolmberg, or the leads are in, are all in Tolmberg. Um, but we're actually not going to do that quite yet, though, because we are going to. Um, yes, that is the baths. Okay, I thought I thought it might. On the th oh god, now I'm in. Is it just because he's not in there? How do I leave? I don't know how to leave without being trespassing. Okay, now I'm not trespassing. I don't think I should steal from this guy. <laughs> not right now. Okay, there we go. Hey, bailiff. What is it? Excuse me. Oh, you bastard. <laughs> okay, um, I'm gonna go in here quickly and have get some repairs done as long as I as long as I can. Taylor, go. <laughs> Actually, I think I need a cobbler. Yeah, I do. Okay, well. What time is it? Uh, it's not quite time to go see Hans yet. But I suppose we could go get our gloves fixed. Because that's always a great old time, isn't it? You know what? I'm dumb. I forgot to use that archery potion at the archery contest. I don't think it would have helped me anyway, because I had that. I might have had a chance if um, if I d wouldn't have screwed up and not had my bow equipped in the beginning, but that really lost me a lot of time. It really did. Okay, the cobbler should be right here. Good evening, sir. Sir Cobbler. I'm honored that you should come to me. Thank you. I would like you to repair my gloves, please. Oh, wait. Wait. Oh, my gloves are armor. That's right. That's right. So, in fact, I think I could go to the blacksmith. He's up here. I passed him. He's beyond this wall, actually. My bad. I wonder if I could say hi to Nightingale again. He was pretty cool. Even though he did have the same voice as every single guard ever. You're not him, are you? No. Pardon me, blacksmith, sir. God be with you. God be with you. Yes. I guess I should have him repair all of my stuff too, yeah. Why not? We're we're there. Can we so. do something about the wanted to break. That's well, weird. we can try. Satisfied? I'd almost shake on that. 
Almost. Nice, nice. 39. All right, so. All right, so. Perfect. Thank you. What have you got, by the way? You got anything new? Any cool new weapons? Nope. Absolutely nothing. That is fine, and I'm not surprised. Let's equip our sword again. Um, we have a lot. We have a lot of piercing arrows. Sixty-one hunting arrows. This is probably weighing us down a bit, isn't it? I would say it probably is. We should sell those. Let's just move them to the horse for now. Oh, my horse can't carry anymore. Well, you know what we should do, actually, in, the, in that case, is let's sell some stuff. Aye, for that nice. amount, I can be persuaded. Okay, that was quite a bit of an extra little bit on top. So, apparently, oh, I should have done this. I'll mess with that another time. That 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 repair wheel intimidates me because I got confused by it in the beta. <laughs> I'm sure there's better instructions now, but I just keep putting it off. And I already bought my repair from the blacksmith. Okay, next is to meet Lord Capone at the baths. Now I'm slightly worried about what's going to happen on this quest. Um because I'm fairly sure Henry's going to end up cheating on Teresa again. But um, I guess you could argue that they're not really dating yet, even though clearly they are. But, um, you know, if I was her and Henry was sleeping around, I would be pretty upset. But who knows? Maybe things are different in the medieval times. It's not like, it's not like this bath wench that he's more than likely going to sleep with is uh, going to be a serious relationship or anything, you know. That's the only excuse I can think of. Not that I'm saying it's justified in any way, but I have a feeling Henry's probably gonna do that because, you know, he's gonna be with Hans. So Hans likes to get up to a bit of shenanigans and I could see that happening. So I think we should go and see if it does. I'm gonna take my horse. Because why not? Yeah. to the entrance. We're gonna just kind of sit around, I think, until it's time to hang out, because I don't really have much else I can do. I mean, I could play dice or something, but meh. Let's just wait. Alright, we found the baths. Surely Hans is around somewhere. Go in the evening to join him. Maybe if I just... Hi. Is Hans here? Hello? I hear someone splashing. way maybe. I think this is trespassing, isn't it? No, it isn't. Okay. Oh, this is, okay. Game saved. Put your torch away, Henry. Thank you. All right. Hey, Hans. He was the splashing culprit. What do you need, sir? I need you to do me a favor, Henry. You're still muddy. Of course. Of course, sir. Good. Oh, you'd never think it. But Stenna here is a demon at dice. Dice, She stripped huh? me bare ass naked. I couldn't even get a ribbon off her. That wasn't the plan. So it didn't quite go as planned. Not quite. But maybe you can do better. Right then. <laughs> You've got dice. To Stenna at dice. I refuse to be the only one here with his ass on show. All right. Why the I hell not? Loaded, loaded dice, so. Right, come on, Zadena. 
Let's let's do this. You ready? Why is there a stretchy texture right there I'm going across the screen? Yo, I'm ready to play dice. Let's get let's get going here. How about a game of dice then? Are you sure? What would I do with two naked men here? Oh gee, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> let's see how good you are. Oh god, I'm gonna have to edit more scenes. Oh. Yes, I would definitely like to use that. Thank you very much. I can't see. I got three fives. It's very dark. Do I want to roll again? I think I'm just going to pass. Don't be afraid of those ducks. Just because they have spots doesn't mean they've got <laughs> to play. <laughs> Good one, Hans. <laughs> She got a thousand right off the bat. Oh, she's got loaded dice. Two, doesn't she? All right, we gotta, we gotta be fearless, don't we? Score and roll again. We're only playing to 1400 too, huh? Oh boy, that's dangerous. That's not enough. It's not enough. Score and roll again. Not enough. Wait, is that a five? I can't tell. I can't see what it is. Selected. I can't hold it, so it must not be a five. Well, let's just keep going. We got a one. Well, we can we can try and get a one because this will at least it could be a three though, and that would be bad. No, I think we should just take it. Okay, she's gonna win. This will be the one. We'll see. Come on, bust. Damn. Oh, I have a chance. I have a chance. That's a six. Okay. Um, score and roll again. I just need 400 points, man. Okay. Loaded dice has not been good to me this time. Oh, it's 300. I gotta go. I gotta go for it. <gasps> no bust. Oh, thank God. Okay. Are you afraid of wearing oh, wait. spots on them? Oh, I thought that was a one. Shit. Oh. I mm. tried. <laughs> tried so hard. Should I? Shouldn't I? No. Okay, she didn't get she didn't get 400. She didn't. Okay. That's a 6, I think. Come on, give me something good. Come on, 2 200. Come on. Come on. What is that? I can't tell what that is. <laughs> I have to hold this five. Oh, this is so dangerous. <gasps> oh. Oh. She only needs 200. Oh, God. Uh, Do I go for it? Oh my god, 
Did I do it? My, my. I won! Oh my Some god, it paid off! Competition at last. You know, I'm playing again. You wait, of course. Wait, we're playing again? <sighs> okay, fine. Oh, good grief, this is stressful. Okay, that's a one. Um, I should hold that. I think, even though it's my loaded die, which sucks. But, yeah. Oof. It's not, this, this isn't going so well this time. I think I should score and pass. I'll just take the 300. Hasn't had the best hand ever yet either. Hopefully not. Okay. Wheels we'll tied now. Come on, bust. Ah! Oh, she's going for it. Mother of God. Yeah, that was a, that was a mistake, man. All right, let's see. We've got a one. Is that a five? I think it's a five. Okay, we're gonna hold that. Roll again. Ooh, there's a one. And a five. We're gonna hold. Hold the die. Roll again. Do, 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 do. Is that a five? Wait, that's a one? I think it's the one. Okay, score and roll again. Might as well. Mm. Let's keep going, I guess. Since we're in the lead. Whew. Score and pass. That's it. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> 250, huh? Well, I'm still in the lead here, which is good. Score and roll again. Nobody's gotten any three of a kinds. It's kind of kind of shenaniganry. Ooh, I gotta take that. I gotta just take the points. This will be the one. Okay. Ooh, she got a three of a kind. Finished. Okay. Oh, snap. Doodly doo doos. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah, I won. I'm the best at dice. Yeah, you better walk away. <laughs> I'm just showing Hans. I up could do left with a good right. soak, too. Then strip off and hop in here. Yeah. All right. Let's why do not? it. Put your clothes in the trunk. Uh oh. Something bad's gonna happen. <laughs> oh. Shift over. Nobody, somebody gonna steal our Don't clothes. Don't tread on anything vital. All right. Just give me a moment and I'll roll it up again. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh. Nice. Oh, that feels good. Man, don't take this personally, but I've never seen a man more in need of a wash. <laughs> I've known cow pats less fragrant. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I just went out of bath yesterday. I was fine. <laughs> you certainly know how to have a good time. Yeah, drink. It's not terribly high quality, but it should do the job. Don't mind if I do. I don't mind if I do. Give me that. That's the spirit. Wait, wasn't he just clean a second ago? So this is how you recuperate from your injuries? Booze and wenches? Of course. Is there any other way? So, what news, Henry? Never mind about me. What about you? Have you recovered from our hunting adventure? I'm well enough, Henry. These baths are just the thing, and Zena here is very healing. Clara, bring some wine for the gents before they get cross. What's going on? Where are we getting up, Henry? You know what, Henry? We really what? can't drink this local piss. Clara, my most favouritest bathmaid. <laughs> most favouritest. Must admit it, my dear. The wine you have here is p p p pitiful. Okay, get back. What's in. wrong with the bathhouse wine? What's going I'd on? I'd rather drink the bath water. You should Ew. go and get something better. Though where? Ah, I know. In the cellars under the rat house, there's some excellent wine that Sir bought for us. And you want me to go there and get it now? I'd be indebted to you. And a grateful nobleman is the best ally you can have. All right, whatever All right, you then. say, Hans. What kind of wine is it? A silver red. In the cellar under the rat house. It's the last barrel at the end on the right hand side. Get a picture somewhere and take it with you. Okay. All right, then. I'll bring it. Good, man. Oh, boy. That silly, silly Hans. Can Be a I bit take... more careful. I'm sorry. Can I just... Can I have my gear back? Oh. Did I already take it back? I did. Okay. <laughs> Apparently I didn't I didn't wash my clothes. Only my only my body. Okay, well. Next time we are going to go and do this for Hans because Henry would do anything for his best friend Hans. I love Hans's character. He's just he's great. He's hilarious. So I can't wait to finish this quest and see what happens. I'm sure it won't be disappointing. But thank you so much for joining me for another episode of Kingdom Come Deliverance, everybody. I will see you very, very soon for another episode, as usual. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.